the Royal Financial Investment Group as always. This is your host, Prince Dykes here, coming to you guys live with another great video. Today's video topic is going to be how to find a mutual fund account that pays dividends. How to find a mutual fund account that pays dividends. This video came about because somebody by the name of uh, the stream name Liberty Justice, if I'm not mistaken, I don't know who that is, but they made a great question. You know, they saw a video that I was sharing that I made about a year or two ago about how parents can save up money and put their child's money into a mutual fund and draw a dividend off of the mutual fund or whatever. And then that person, and in that video, I said, Hey, you can put your child's mutual fund, I'm mean, gonna put your child's money into a mutual fund that draws 4%. And pay that to your kid as a dividend. Not a dividend, but as an allowance. Use a dividend as an allowance. As the principal continues to grow. And somebody said, Prince, 4%? That's great. Where's a mutual fund that pays 4%? I said, hey, no problem. I went to go find one of my videos that I made about it. And I realized that I made a video on how to find stocks that pay dividend. But I, had, I didn't have a mutual fund. I didn't have a video about how to make um, how to find mutual funds that pay dividends. So I said, you know what? Guess what? It's time to go back to the lab and come up with another great video. So this is why this video is here. So literally just this is for you. And I decided to go a video because I figured it's probably more people out here with the same exact question. So here it is. So here you're logged on the E-Trade, right? So the first thing you're going to do, you see this big button up here that's green that says research. We're going to click on it. Once you click on the word, we just want to click on research altogether, right? And then when you get to the word research, now we're going to use research. We'll go to products. My bad. I'm sorry about that. Research. We're going to go to products, and then we're going to go to mutual fund. See that? Research, products, mutual fund. Click on that word mutual funds, right? So you're going to come up to this thing with a mutual fund screener. So you see this tab here, which is green. Now it says mutual fund screener. So it's going to stream mutual funds or whatever. Click on that. Now, when you click on it, this is the way that you can filter out mutual funds. Say, hey. I want a mutual fund that has performed this way. I want a mutual fund that has an expense ratio of this and the fees of this or whatever. And over here on this left side, this is how you can break down what you're looking for in a mutual fund. You know, you have fund categories. You can save some searches. You want to see what a rating is on a fund, the performance, the distribution yield. That's pretty much dividend. That's what we're going to click on, right? We're going to say right here, you can say, hey, I want to see a fund that's less than 3%. That's from 3% to 5% or oh, that's over 5%. As you can see, I have here clicked on more than 5%. So make it green. So now that it's green, all these funds here, which you have 249, pay over 5%. In the video I used four, I lowballed it, remember? So here, all these mutual funds. So I'm just going to click on one, for example. So you click on it and you're saying, okay, Prince, how I know what this mutual fund pays? Just giving you a snapshot. So if you want to know what this mutual fund is about, you can read here. This investment seeks the total return consistent, you know, with yada, 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 whatever, long-term growth or whatever. So that's the goal of this mutual fund. So you're going to say, hey, you click on this word portfolio. See that word portfolio? Click on that word portfolio. Once you click on this word portfolio, this is going to break it all down. No hiding when you get to the portfolio. Portfolio is going to tell you where my dog on money is because, you know, the mutual fund is just taking up, you know, all your money and it's putting into a bunch of different things, right? So this can break it down to international exposure, where it's going or whatever. And just to uh, click on, not click on, but to show you down here, it tells you uh, the top 10 holdings of where this money is. So it's, you can look at this and you can look at all the other good stuff. But we're not into that. We're here for the dividend. Right here, you see that? What does that say? 6.62 yield. Oh, I can't. There we go. 6.62 oh, yield. That is what this fund pays. 6.62. In the video, we use what? Bam, you guys got a good memory, 4%. You guys are good, man, great. So you can click on the word yield here, and it'll tell you. I don't know what the yield is. Yield is the amount of income of a fund, it's a, a fund produces every year, usually in the form of dividend and interest, expenses and percentage and share prices, you know. And it gives you a breakdown. For example, if a fund starts with a net asset of $10 and pays out $1 in dividends, over the course of a year, its dividend is 10%. Because you got $10 and you got 1%, you got $1 over the year, that's 10% yield, right? So here, this is saying you're paying you 6.62. Now that you got this great tool, you can go and have all the type of fun you want to find a dividend that you would love to put your kids' stuff in, 
right? Or your kids, your stuff, your cousin stuff, or whatever. Now I want you to go see what your bank is giving you. Don't worry, I'll wait. If you find a bank giving you over 6%, please inbox me immediately. But, um, you know, 6% is nice. You know, you can find your mutual fund that you like. And then if you want to search mutual funds, I have videos on that. You find a mutual fund that you like, and then you can see what it's yielding. And, you know, I don't want to get in detail about what the video is about because that's what the video is for. You can go see about it where how your kid can save, um, how you can use, you can save up money to pay your kids the dividends. You know, it's a great little concept. So people were saying, you know, I don't like to leave people dead hanging. So here, I closed the loop. I only didn't tell you how to do it. I showed you. How many people out there doing that? Anyway. Thank you guys for supporting me. I just found that I hit over 2,500 subscribers, which I am ecstatic about. Yeah, some people may look at 2,000 subscribers as nothing, but I came from the bottom and I remember recording videos in my garage two or three years ago. And to see it now and with no followers for months. So, you know, to get up now to have some subscribers up to 2,500, I'm glad that you guys are finding the videos and responding to them and finding them and all of the good stuff and liking them and sharing them. Good stuff. Anyway, thank you guys. Now, once again, it's another video. I only do this at the end of the video because I know if you listen to this video, you probably are a real fan to hear me ramble on after the topic was over. I did that intentionally to filter out most people. So now it's the end of the video. You guys know what time it is. You guys know I published my first book called what? Man, Wesley Learns to Invest. You guys are good. So that book is out. Great book. It's available hard copy paperback and also available electronic copy and you can get it at lulu.com that's www.lulu.com look up the word wesley learns to invest and send your copy and don't forget to give me a response if you do also on top of that uh it's going to be going to amazon here in a few weeks and it's going to be going to barnes and nobles and ibooks all of the good stuff so support it support me you know and let me know if you guys got any questions don't forget to uh drop the comments below and also here it is again write in hashtag 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 wesley learns to invest i want it now don't forget on the youtube video not on somebody else's facebook whatever you hear this video your video from write in i want wes you know i want it now hashtag wesley learns to invest i want it now hashtag wesley learns to invest if you are the first person to drop that below on this video, you just gonna win. You're gonna you're gonna have a, a soft copy of my first book, West Learn to Invest, sent to your house. So don't forget to write in on pay attention on the YouTube channel on this video on YouTube. Be the first person to comment with I want it now. Hashtag Wesley Learns to Invest. Go ahead and do that. And if you're the first person you get it, if you're not the first person, stay tuned. There'll be plenty more. Anyway, you guys know what to do. Be safe.